In this demonstration, we'll look at the change management integration from Enlight. This uh, will use ServiceNow. There are other options available. For the user, this presents in the process designer the ability to do integration requests at multiple points in a workflow and adds the ability to then tie into the change management system to create change requests, get change requests, and update those requests. Also, the fields that are mapped and exchanged are user configurable and updatable within the workflow system. There may be cases when I want to initiate a workflow from within Enlight, such as in this example, a maintenance window on a power supply. So I'm initiating a workflow in Enlight, and this is going to automatically, based on the definition of the workflow, go out and create a change request within the ServiceNow system. So we see the first couple steps have completed. And if we look at the create CRQ, there's information that's been returned, such as the change ID. If we look in ServiceNow and open up our change requests, we see that new change request has been created, and then the flow can wait for external approval, get updates, keep ServiceNow update as to, pro as to progress. The opposite may be true as well. I may need to initiate an Enlight workflow, uh, maybe around a new deployment from ServiceNow. So here I've queued up a new request to deploy equipment. I'll submit that request. That change request will get built within ServiceNow, as well as initiate a workflow within Enlight for the data center uh, personnel to do planning and deployments around that new deployment. Here we can see that change that was just created and came across and was generated by the ServiceNow request.